So the all-in-one views, and we're going to do, we'll take a look at a vendor all-in-one view. So I'm going to go into purchasing and then go to cards and vendors and bring up our vendors. And we're going to take a look at my vendor advanced. So once you have your vendor brought up, you can click on this all-in-one view button. And what that's going to do is that's going to load all of the information, the top five, for each of the different transactions that this vendor is attached to. So we can look at purchase orders, we can look at the receipts related to those purchase orders, we can look at the invoices, and then we can look at any payments. So I can drill back into that purchase order, and I can get into the purchase order and see the additional information related to it. If there's something specific that I'm looking for, we can do that. We can drill into the line item detail, see the accounts that are assigned to it. Maybe there's um, receipt dates, promise information. You can see all that from this window, and you have it all in one very convenient place that you can access. So if you're looking for something specific or you just need a summary at a quick glance, you can see where that vendor's at. Do the same thing with receivings. To see the receipt information here, you can do the same thing with payments where you're drilling back into that payables transaction. Maybe you want to see the distributions on that. You can see the distributions here for the payments, which will be your cash and payables. At the bottom, you have the ability to move to the next five in the columns that have more than five uh, receipts, in this case, or invoices to display. Once you click on the next one, then you can then click previous to go back. 